Welcome everybody, welcome back to Homestead Heart. And today, we are talking Broody Mama Diaries. Again, 2020. But this time, it's the duck edition. Y'all stay tuned. Okay, let's go in. Little silky smooth. Big red. And Lil Red. <laughs> Let me in, folks. Let me in so we can talk Beauty Mama Diaries Duck Edition. How's everybody doing this morning? Mm -mm. Can't go out there. All right, now. There go Bill. Daisy's already outside. But over here, we have our girl. That's Billie Jean, y'all. And Billie Jean is sitting on about four eggs right now. She had seven. Two got smushed. One, I don't know what happened to it, but I don't know what happened to that seventh egg. I don't know if she kicked it out or, and one of the other chickens did something to it. They pecked, I don't know what happened to that egg. I came out here one day, there was no sign of it, no sign of a, a shell, nothing, just nothing. But anyway, that's Billie Jean. And Billie Jean is sitting on four. Thanks, Silk Smooth. Billie Jean is sitting on four babies, and she's not having it when you go over and want to just, you know, look at her baby eggs, see how they're coming along. She ain't playing that kind of stuff, okay? So we're just going to have to stay updated on Billie Jean to see what's going on with her and her babies. But she's so good, and I give her her own feed. Now, she will get up. And she will come out and she'll get her own water and play in her pond and she'll do that a good five or ten minutes and then she comes right back and gets on her nest. So Billie Jean is doing a good job. Ain't you girl? Look at her. She's looking at me like, yep, I'm doing good. I ain't moving. Holding it down, mom. I'm holding it down. <laughs> Said the tradition. If y'all don't settle down, I know. I know I said duck edition, but I have got to show y'all this. Our broody mamas have gone broody crazy this year. I mean broody crazy this year. So I'm going to show y'all what we got going on. I ain't having no more broody mamas this year. I mean, they're going to have to they're gonna have to do something different, but we ain't doing no more of this. Not this year. And they trying. I had three over there this morning. Look at her. Wait a minute. What's she at? Is that her? Yeah, that's her right there. I'm taking them eggs. I show sure am. We ain't doing this no more this year. Y'all look at this. Look at her. This is Mrs. Freckles. And Mrs. Freckles has been sitting on about a dozen eggs. And she has three hatchlings right about now, y'all. Three. You can't see it, but there's one right under her on this side right here. That's one. And the other two are just tucked up under their mama. And she still got eggs sitting up under her. Now, she get an attitude when you get too close. You know what I'm saying? When you start moving around and stuff, she start getting all, you know, she start catching her attitudinal problem. So, I don't bother her too much. But she is in a tote. And she is, has her own food and water because her babies have started hatching out. So, she's doing good. But as we swing around to this, wait a minute. She had her little baby was just out. He ran. I'm going to try to catch him. <laughs> I'm going to try to catch him so I can get y'all a shot of him. But look. Look right here. Look at our broody mama right there. Let me see if I can get a good shot of her for you. Look at her. She is sitting on the house. Excuse me, but I'm trying to do a video here. She's sitting on about seven eggs herself, okay? I'm letting her. Now, she hasn't hatched out any yet, but they should be hatching out any day now. However, her sister look just like her, call her Big Mama. This little mama. But we got Big Mama. And Big Mama, you see these babies right here? Look at them. Look at them. 
They everywhere. Look at them. Look at them. Hold on. I think I got some more behind me. Hold up. Now we got we got some meat birds out here too. So you see them big white ones. I ain't talking about them. But you see the rest of these right here? Look at all them babies. It was 26 chickens that hatched out about a month ago. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so we got 26 babies. She is sitting. Oh, there go another one right there. 26 babies. She's sitting on about. I forgot. She ain't gonna let me get under there and see. And then this mama right here. Oh, look at her little baby sitting up under her under her wing. Do y'all see the baby sitting under her wing? There he is, sitting right under her wing. Isn't that precious? Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Look at you. Well, welcome, welcome, welcome. And then we got that one that just hatched out. You see him moving right there, staying tucked under mama. But there's another one under mama too that just won't come out. But she's doing a wonderful job. She's doing a wonderful job. She's such a good mama. Good job, Mrs. Freckles. But as you can see, she's in a tote. And I got a lid that came off of this other tote right here. Because I put this tote right here and I turned it sideways. See here? I turned it sideways. But I did that so that my little babies would feel comfortable having a nice little place to run whenever they felt like they needed to just, you know, pile up together. So, all of my little babies, there they are. Look at them. There goes some more. Over there. They're just everywhere. See what I'm saying? <laughs> so, yeah, they have their own water in here, food. They got plenty of feed. But this is the nursery. This is the nursery right here, y'all. Look at them all piled up over there together. Ooh, let me get out of here. <laughs> and there's their feed. But we ain't finna do this no more. I'm taking that egg. <laughs> I'm taking them eggs that she got. She ain't holding on to them. They are gonna go. So I have them, as you can see, we divided this coop up last year. And I'm so glad we did because now this side is just the nursery for our babies. And we got the big chicks over there, right? Look at them. So happy. And when it was cooler out here, we got, let me see, that's a fly trap right there. That works so good. But we had the, the heat lamps up, and that really helped to keep them warm when it was cold out. So it did a fantastic job. We just got it mounted up, you know, using scrap wood. Got it mounted up, and we got the electric line running in so that we can keep them warm when it was cold. But we could take these out now. It is hot as all. Get out. So they won't be needing those. But y'all, our babies are doing so well. And so is Mrs. Freckles. They're her other baby. They're her baby. They're her babies. <laughs> All right, Billie Jean. You're doing a good job, Mama. I'm not going to interrupt you. I just want you to smile. See the people? Don't fluff up at me now. Just for showing the people. That's all. Just showing the people. Isn't she beautiful? She's such a good mama, y'all. She's doing great. <coughs> Do it for this first episode, 2020 of Rudy Mama Diaries, Duck Edition. But I had to show you the other broody mamas, right? They are doing so good. So we have 25 plus in there already that hatched out well over a month ago. And then we have them sitting on more eggs. And that is it. I'm not allowing any more Booty Mama Diaries this year, but that's okay. Because there is a plan for why we are allowing them to hatch out so many chickens, okay? So it's not that we're gonna have a ton of laying hens. We have a plan. And I will give you a hint on that, but we're going to talk about it in another episode. But all of our chickens are dual purpose, okay? So I'm going to leave it right there. <laughs> all right, y'all, that's going to do it. If you haven't done so already, go ahead and give our video a thumbs up. Hit that notification bell after you subscribe to our channel so you don't miss a single video that we upload to our channel. Thank you so much for watching Homestead Heart.
Peace and blessings to each and every one of you. I'll see you in the next video.